house doesn't go any further. You son of a bitch! You wouldn't have stopped. Get out. No, not until you admit that you're settling for Scott. Go! Leave me alone. Go back to your perfect little wife. I wonder how Marissa would feel about this little test. You shut up about my wife. Go. Go, or I will call the police and swear that you tried to rape me. Why would you think that? Uh, I uh, thought you were my mom. Oh, really? Do I look like her? No. I'll try not to be insulted, might I? <laughs> we actually we had a civilized moment. She saw some of my design sketches, acted like she wanted to see more. I went and got them, came back, and now she's well, she's gone. I am so sick of every person checking out on me. She didn't check out. She came over to Tad's. Why? She saw some text on your phone about tomorrow night. Oh, my God. Yeah, she freaked out. Said there was no way she would let us be together tomorrow and definitely not in New York. I knew she'd never back off. She basically accused me of trying to steal you away from her. Well, she used to always accuse my dad of that. And then she did the exact same thing. Hmm. We were on the run for years. I used to look out my window when I was a little girl and just wish I could go home. I said the same thing. Except I would wish that someone would take me away from my home. With my dad, I just never felt like I belonged. And I'm with you. I don't need to look out my window anymore. Me neither. Is, is there any chance I could uh, sit on the pride side? I'd like Amanda to know that she isn't alone. She is so lucky to have a mama-in-law like you, you oh, know. I'm, so I'm the one mom. who's lucky. I always heard that about you. Oh, yeah. oh hey, mom. <laughs> oh, I need that. <laughs> Must have been a rough flight. Oh, you no, are I like terrible. Ice cream stuff. No hitting. Stop. I got a oh, oh, loves it. So do I. I'm leaving you to him. Oh, really? mm -hmm. oh okay. All right. <laughs> well, how, how is uh, Crystal? Uh, Crystal is kind of nuts ever since she bought BJ's. Um, and the girls. Growing like weeds. Oh, uh, although I got to tell you, it's not real, you know, if you and Dad aren't around to witness it. Oh, no. I, I don't want to even think about that. Um, how, how, is, uh, how are things with uh, Liza? You still going strong? Hmm? Two of you? You must be thirsty after your flight. Let me get you something. Hi. Weren't you just at that guy's house? Yes, it was. Did Todd give you my number? No, actually, I Googled you. I figured since he had to cancel at the last minute that you might be free. Free for what? Well, you know the, uh, the youngest of the three guys that you saw at Tad's? Dark hair, bedroom eyes? Yep, that is the one. What about him? Well, he's going to be at the bachelor party tonight, and I was hoping that you would take care of him. <laughs> take care how? What I'd like you to do is actually lure him out very discreetly and uh, get him into bed. FYI, I'm not a hooker. I'm not asking you to seal the deal. I'm just asking you to keep him there long enough for my daughter to show up. And there's a thousand dollars in it for you. So, Bedroom Eyes is your daughter's boyfriend, and you don't like him. Are you interested or not? Let me think about it. Okay, well, it is uh, tonight or never. 